Welcome to Aussie Coin Hunter, episode 38, part 3 of the Bush Adventure. We've got a massive hill over here with an antenna on it. It's pretty impressive coming out of the, um, the flat ground. All around, you've got this massive big hill. I bet you they don't have hill trolley derbies down there. <laughs> By the time you hit the bottom you did about 200. Okay, we've got a bit of an Indiana Jones bridge here. <laughs> Alright, we are coming on this York Walk Bridge. Suspension bridge across the... Bloody hell. Across the, the river. What did it say, Dad? York was the first inland town or something? So we're just going over the suspension bridge. Oh, that's comforting. There's a couple of patchy marks there. <laughs> Coming up to this very old church. We're in York. I think I said that already. And this is what? This is where. Got my guts outside the church, live on video. <laughs> this was damaged by the earthquake, she was split up. Oh, ah, yeah. And Must have been a bit naughty and... <laughs> the windows were broken. Yeah. And they were replaced by juniper. Hmm. Stained glass windows. Okay. I don't know if, it, if it's open or not. Oh, the English flag is flying. Yeah, that's English. So this was You're welcome, but you can't All are welcome, but I think just don't try and open the door. <laughs> I think they close it during after a certain time it is doing four. Okay. Eight AM weekly. Mm -hmm. So Yeah, when you get inside all the Alright, and this and this is the church where my ancestors were, were married, was it? The Wilkerson's. <coughs> Got all the earthquake damage there. You can see up under the window. And they got married in this church. Some of them did. Okay. Unfortunately, these two outhouses were saved from the earthquake. <laughs> so they've been here for, it doesn't say how long, does it? Big crack up the middle from an earthquake. 18, 15, 14th of February 1858. To reenact some Indiana Jones <laughs> on this bridge. <laughs> it's very wobbly. And I don't think, even if I had a, a machete, it would chop this big steel cable somehow. Mm. They probably don't come down this one for the Avon descent, do they? Alright, we're in the main street of York. Historic York Courthouse. Some old, there's an 1892, 1907 Collins Building, Davies Castle Hotel, 1853. So, yeah, the town hall. Look at, look at the town hall. My goodness. Nice big old house here. Town hall. Look at it. No wonder they had the biggest building, they had all the taxes. A few big cottages and things. A couple of old houses still here. No. Oh. 
Okay. Got a big truck there. The mill. So this was the mill, was it? Yeah, it used to be Jar Rock Gallery. Yeah. They called it the mill. That's the mill emporium. So here we go, we're leaving New York now. Calling it a day. I'll show you the finds in just today. We just pulled off the big highway from York and we're going down this bush track. Oh, crikey! We're going to Three Mile Well, what was it? Yep. Is that right? Three Mile Well, and Three. apparently this is where they used to water the horses. If you look through there, you can see water. Can we jump out? Yeah, you can. So they used to come to this? Okay. Oh yeah, I can see rocks there on the edge. Alright, so we're going to jump out and maybe get the detector out, I think. We'll do a, qu a quick coil change from small to the large. And we're going to go around this old watering hole. Alright, yeah. there we are. Rowan's well. It's pretty cool, really, isn't it? See, out here in the middle of nowhere. So what would this be? Kind of like a billabong. Why is that like that? Is that just... Somebody's had a fire by the thing here. They've built up the edge. The rocks there, a bit of a wall happening. And they used to what, water all the horses and... Okay, so I'm gonna just gonna go around this real quick, hopefully, and see what we can do. Three by the water's edge here, and I've got what looks like the back end of a shotgun round. Gonna have to clean that up. Dig down in this hole. I've got about a sixty. What a, I'll just do a. I've got what looks like a um, splattered bullet. That's what it looks like, hey. It's got rings on it too. Hmm. All right, we just dug up another bullet, bullet cartridge case. We have to look into that. Oh, come on! It's not focusing. A bit later. Haven't got me gloves. Oh, I think I saw it then. Yeah, I did. It's a .22 bullet, I'd suggest. It's a casing. Another one. .22 shell. Shouldn't be doing this with no gloves. Ooh. Ooh, shotgun chart. Hello. Yeah, shotgun. Back of a shotgun round. Another one. It's two, Dad. In the same hole. We're running out of battery power. Alright, we're really doing some bush bashing now. Yeah, we're looking for, it says on the sign there that they're going to, that they're looking to restore the ruins of a con convict, what? Convict holding site. Yeah. So when they were travelling, maybe they're bringing them up here to work or something. Plaques up there, look. Aha, right, there we can see more plaques in the bush. Found uh, predominantly bullet shells, shotgun shells, just around there in the brief scan. We didn't do a real methodical one. Now let's have a look what this is. I reckon it's that missing side. What's this here? Oh, well, that could be a dam though. I reckon that would be the missing sign. So we're going to turn around 
We're out in the bush. The bush. We're about 50 kilometers from, from or 60 kilometers from Earth. Yeah. I think they probably heard you on that one, Dad. <laughs> <laughs> so, yeah, that was kind of cool. We're going to do our homework. Come back. So we might save that for another day. Oh, something under the... Do you want me to see if it's probably a stick? No, I've got the wheel switch on the train. The what? Uh, it doesn't even show on the map. <laughs> and there's the watering hole. As we wave goodbye as the sun sets slowly in the west. <laughs> so that's a bit, that's, when did they do when did they come here since Captain Sterling? 1830. 1830. And they built a convict depot here in 1850. Uh-huh. Couldn't find any place. No. I thought I saw a convict running in the bush, but I only thought I did. A nice orangey sunset there. Alright, we're on our way back. Got some nice trees on the side of the road. Found a car down at the river in York. Oh, where was that, Dad? That was Northern. This is a big lead weight sinker fishing sinker thing. I don't know what the heck that's doing in the playground. What does it say? Forty fourteen dollars, Dad. Fourteen dollars in coins. Two cent coin there. Where is it? Oh, yeah, two cent coin. Found this. Um, kind of a lid with a nice design. Dad says it's, he reckons it might be scotch whiskey or some kind of jar or something. So clean that up a little bit. Then uh, we've got all these bullets from the, uh, what was it called? Rowan's Well. They're 0 .22, 0 .22 bullets. And there's a couple here that we don't know what they are. Got a splattered round, which I think you saw. It looks like a bullet that's splattered, that's for sure. We'll look into that. Uh, three shotgun shells. Th this one here, Dad, I reckon that's that's an old one. Anyway, we've got to look into that. These uh, That kind of looks like a bit of a hacksaw blade or something. We found a, a 1944 uh, penny, Australian penny, under a tree in Northern, which is pretty cool. And then when we look in the coin guide, 1944, 720,000, three dollars. So that, I don't know, Dad reckons you might get a dollar or something for it. And then uh, the best one, I think, was, um, for me anyway, was finding this one with Dad, uh, finding all of them with Dad really, but finding this 1922. That one's not actually worth a great deal, but... That was really cool when we found that, so. Alright, well that's the wrap up. Thanks Dad. Dad's having some dinner. Mm. And um, thanks Mum. <laughs> Alright, that's All right, it. Alright guys, that's it. The third and final part of the video. Uh, I want to give a great big thanks to Dad. It was a great, awesome idea and he offered to take us out there and we went uh, around together. That was the best part, was going around with my Dad. Uh, always remember that, it's awesome. Uh, the Remington uh, shotgun shells were mid to late 1800s and uh, the Winchester shells uh, were the long Winchester shells but they'd been eaten away. They were uh, 1800s as well. Uh, the highlight was the 1922 penny and um, spending time with Dad. Please leave comments and I'll catch you soon. Happy hunting.